So today I am going to be doing a what is in my Fial Raven backpack. This is a video for all my commuters that don't have a car, that when they leave their house in the morning, they need to have everything on them because they don't have a car that they're keeping stuff in or they can't get easily back to their house. So I'm gonna show you all the necessities. If you guys aren't familiar with the Fial Raven brand, they're kind of overpriced backpacks, but honestly, I like them because they are water resistant and they do hold up really nicely. My first ever Fjall Raven backpack was the yellow one that my friend Quincy got me for Christmas one year. I think I was like a freshman or sophomore in college and I had it for a really long time, but it was like beat to hell. I had to get rid of it. So I'm actually getting the tote pack in a few days, but I figured why wait? because I'm just gonna be taking what's in this bag and putting it in that bag, so it really doesn't make a difference. But I'm getting the tote pack because even though I love my backpack, like when I go out to restaurants or bars, it's just kind of easier to have something that I can also use as a backpack and put on my shoulder so I don't look like a child. Anyway, let's get into it. On this side pocket, I have my water bottle that I actually picked up at the Fjall Raven backpack store um, because these water bottles are specifically made for the backpacks, which I was using, I think like a really small hydro flask before, but this one, it's a pretty decent size and it fits perfect, that's a necessity. On the other side, I have my little umbrella, also a necessity because when I leave the house, if it decides to rain, I won't have shelter. I also have a little clip that I keep on the front to clip my hair up if I need to. Now, the front pocket. I have two pins. This is a Chicago pin and this is a New Orleans pin. In the front pocket I have some Tic Tacs, wintergreen, my fave, some hand sanitizer, my agenda book and a pencil. My agenda book is my life. I have like my bills and when they need to be paid in the back. I keep track of my subscribers, I keep track of my debt, all in the back. And then I just have like my day-to-day -day appointments, weddings, whatever I'm doing. I also have this reusable bag that I got at Target. I am a very organized person, so when I open up this big pocket, I, this is not like something that I did just for this video. I am organized like this on a daily basis because I just hate having stuff all over the place. So. Let's get into the main compartment. <laughs> I have my wallet. It's Vera Bradley. It's the trifold. I have this little bag that keeps my camera in it, but obviously I'm using my camera right now, so it's not inside of here. But it is this cute little bag that I picked up at TJ Maxx for a couple bucks, and it fits my vlogging camera perfectly. So it's nice and safe. In this pocket where the pad is, I have some wipes when my hands are dirty, when anything is dirty on my body, I use one of my wipes and we're all good. And then I just have this big bag. That is all that's in the main compartment. Now you're probably like, why have such a big bag for not that many items? When I am going out for the day, I'll usually throw a jacket in there. I have a little bit of room in my bag so that I can throw some extra stuff in there, a snack. So that is why I use a big bag. In my little mini bag, I have, let's get her out of the way for this second. My Kiehl's Ultra Facial Cleanser. It is a one fluid ounce, just the travel size. I like to keep this because it removes makeup. And if I've had a long day, I can just quickly go into a bathroom and just take my makeup off wherever I am. I have my vaccination card. I have a mask. deodorant, a hairbrush, and a little scrunchie on the side, my CeraVe healing ointment, I have insanely dry skin, probably from this weather, but throughout the day, if I'm out and I'm taking my mask on and off, like the sides of my mouth and around my face will get dry, so I will just put a little bit of this on so I don't look all crusty in public. I have a drip drop 
orange electrolyte powder. I always keep one of these on me because I don't drink enough water. These packets are always good to have. I have my toothbrush. Toothpaste. My NYX butter glass in the shade Brownie Drip. I have a little pill case with Pepto-Bismol, Tylenol, I think that's all that's in this because those are like the two things that when I'm out I will need at some point because if I get a stomach ache or if I have acid reflux or if I get a headache, necessary. I have two band-aids, one for each heel because often I walk a lot and I get blisters constantly. I have my sunglasses. I'll try them on for you guys. I can't wear my sunglasses unless I have my contacts in because I cannot see. So, sorry if you hear my obnoxious neighbor upstairs. I just can't get rid of him. Doesn't matter what time of day I film, he's up 24 seven, playing video games, pissing me off. So, don't mind him. I feel like the baddest with these glasses on, honestly. Can't wait for it to be sunny so I can wear them. It's a very dreary day here in Chicago. Oh, and they're Vogue. I ordered them from the Sunglass Hut. They were having a sale. They were like $50, so. Fabulous deal. And then I have a few Q-tips. I keep Q-tips for multiple reasons. If my mascara is on my eyelids, if I, this is gonna be a TMI, but I have my nose pierced, so sometimes I just have to like, boop, <laughs> get in there. And lastly, I have a pair of tweezers. So, that is all that I have in my bag. And honestly, it doesn't seem like a lot, but to me it feels like a lot when I'm carrying around and it's a little bit heavy. My bag is the standard Konkin in black. When I get the toe pack, I want either the khaki color or the gray color because even though I love this bag, she gets dirty really quickly. There is always lint and I even, the first day that I had it and I wore it out, I got on the bus and I must have scratched something on the bus. Like there's all these marks on it now. Ugh, I won't be getting the black ever again. Do you hear this man? Honestly. I wasn't gonna film a video this week because I'm having like a very rough week. I don't have a day off until next Saturday, so that's me working. I, my next day off, I would have worked like 14 days straight without a day off, so. Yeah, so I would have worked by the time that I get my next day off, which is next Saturday, 14 days in a row without a day off. So I've been having a little bit of a rough week, but I'm persevering because I am going home to Massachusetts for nine days in about two weeks. So I need to be working right now because I'm gonna be missing nine days of work. So, but it's just tough working that much without a day off. Especially like this week, it has been halfway decent weather-wise. But I get out during the day when it is nice and try to absorb some of that sunshine. So that all fits back in there perfectly. And I still have room. Like when I go to Massachusetts in two weeks, I'll put my charger, my birth control, stuff that I leave on my counter on a daily basis. I can fit it in here perfectly and it won't be too big. This is also something I got at TJ Maxx, if I didn't mention that already. But it has mini on it, and it's so cute. Taking the thumbnail real quick. <laughs> that is what is in my Fial Raven backpack. And I will show you guys what my tote pack looks like when I do get it in one of my next videos. But I hope that it has the room this one does because I heard that 
the tote pack can be a little bit more difficult to get in and out of just because it's just a zipper on the top it doesn't zip all the way around so you can't like fold it over you kind of have to dig through a little bit but i'm pretty organized so i don't think that's going to be too much of a problem with me i'm just trying to figure out if i want the mini or the regular size this bag is a little big um when i do like i said go out to bars or clubs i don't usually bring it but like i like to have all this stuff on me so i want to be able to bring it i just don't want to be walking around looking like a schoolgirl at 2 a.m i hope you guys enjoyed this video again i wasn't gonna film today it is a very dreary day i have work in about an hour but i want to be consistent on my channel and post once a week because I do have a subscriber goal that I hope to reach by the time I leave Chicago and embark on my new adventure that I will talk about at some point. I just don't want to talk about it yet. But consistency is key, so please like, comment, and subscribe. And also comment on this video what your favorite Fjall Raven backpack color is. Because even though I want the khaki or the gray one for the tote pack, I'm open to suggestions. I just, I always get black or gray because it matches with everything. I'll look at the comments and check out if you guys have a really cool color that you suggest that doesn't get dirty quickly. Thank you so much and I will see you in the next video.